that. It's still going. <laughs> it's still going. How are you alive? How are you alive, bro? Have you ever wondered what the biggest explosion you can make in Dying Light 2 looks like? Well, we are going to be doing just that. Stick around to the end of the video to see the damage 5000 C4 can cause. So first I had to look around for a good area and came across this bus next to the indoor pool. I decided this was the perfect area to do my tests. I started with 100 landmines and it seemed to have some lively jiggles happening, like it was coming to life. This is what 100 landmines looks like. Let's see what kind of explosion they can make. Now we just need to find a victim to come back to our bus with us. I had to drag the dude the entire way and just kick them into the mines hoping that my kick wasn't enough to kill them. One hundred landmines already had a big explosion, but I knew I needed more, so I started on my way to placing 500 more mines and it took a pretty long time. This is what 500 mines looks like and you'll notice the lively jiggle a bit more from this amount. Also, my game was lagging quite hard as well. Let's see if we can find another victim to test this out on. Well that was 500 landmines, let's now see what 1000 would look like as well. For the remainder of the video, I'll have both audio from the future, such as this, as well as from my mic while I was doing this, so you can hear my first hand reaction to the coming explosions. But anyway, let's get placing 1000 landmines, and let me tell you, this took a while. That's all of them. That's a thousand. That's a thousand freaking landmines in one place. <laughs> Holy crap. That's a lot of landmines. I can't even... Oh, look how choppy that is. I'm sure that's terrible to look at. Oh my god. So after placing 1,000 landmines, my game was lagging and the lively jiggle was back in full swing as hard as ever. We just made a monster that will destroy anything that goes near it. Let's try to see if we can get a victim to pay this monster a visit. Did I get that guy too? Yeah, come on. I know you want to see what's I know you want to see what's going on with this pile, right? Cuz I'm kind of curious as well. Okay, one more kick. Is that enough? That wasn't enough. How close do I got to be? I was close enough. I kicked. Just get off of me and go taste the power of the end. Oh, that's it. That's it. That's game over. I think he got close enough. I'm trying to step back. I'm holding backwards right now. My game is frozen. Or is, is, oh, oh it is. Look at that. <laughs> frame by frame, we are seeing this. This is like zero point, like zero, 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 seven, zero, zero, zero. Oh, yep, frames per second. Look at that. Oh, wow. That's just straight up fireworks. That's literally one of the biggest explosions I've seen in dying light like holy crap that is massive how are you alive how are you alive bro how here you want round two come here don't do it don't do it no no <laughs> they just walked into it again oh look at that explosion that's so awesome is he alive still oh they were look at that this zombie is god tier after seeing that 1000 landmine explosion, I knew I wanted to kick it up a notch. I decided I was going to do a mass amount of C4, but I wasn't sure on the amount just yet, so I slowly built up my pile of C4. Holy crap, that is a thousand. A thousand C4 on the side of this bus. As you can see, it's clearly not lagging as bad, but like it is still lagging. Oof, um, I think I'm going to aim a little bit higher. I think I want to put a little bit more on here. Um, I know it's a lot as is like, holy crap. That's a lot of C4. That's a thousand C4 on the side of this bus. <laughs> but um, I think I want to throw some more. So yeah, let's try that out. Let's keep let's keep throwing some more down. <laughs> 
This is what 1000 C4 looks like, and it doesn't look like much compared to the landmines. Also, my game isn't lagging nearly as bad, so I decided I'd place another 1000 and see what was happening around then. That right there is 2,000 freaking things. Holy crap, bro. That is 2,000 explosives. It's telling me to remote activate them. It's like, do it. The game can't handle anymore, please. After placing another 1,000, this is what 2,000 C4 looks like strapped to the side of a bus in Dying Light 2. Again, it's not lagging that bad. I knew at this point I had to aim big, so I shot for the stars. Holy crap, <laughs> and that is 3,000. We're actually starting to hit that lag moment where um, I was lagging with the other ones, which are still a little bit floating. You know, there's still two of them there, but I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm starting to lag. I'm not gonna lie, the game's warning me again. It's like, activate the remote explosives, please. <laughs> oh man. All right, so I think I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna try to hit 5,000 like I mentioned. This might break my game, you know, break my computer, but let's hope for the best. We hit 3000 C4 a while after and it started picking up in lag. Soon after came 4000 and I knew I had to keep going. After placing down the last C4, we had 5000 C4 strapped to the side of a bus and my game was lagging so hard. After finally getting in position, which was difficult to say the least, I pulled the trigger and blew up the 5000 C4. This is what that looks like and then we'll go ahead and we'll just go for it you know i think we're okay i think we're okay at this distance to to just blow up the nuke it doesn't matter wherever we're at it's just gonna kill us anyway three two two and a half one go no oh gosh you just see his hand come up and just ding. My game is frozen, pretty much. I can still hear the sounds, so I know it's still going. Oh, there's there's the first the first frame that we get to see of this. Holy crap! I think it's gonna hit me from here. Like I'm not that far away. I'm not gonna lie, and it's like painted this bus. Like <laughs> this bus is being painted right now. Holy crap! And that's the explosion. Holy crap, look at that explosion. It looks like the sun, like what? No way, that's crazy. We just made a sun. That's, <laughs> that's what we just did. After a moment, I realized not all of the C4 went off. So I started just spamming the activation button and the explosion was becoming massive from all of the C4. Oh, they're still exploding. Yeah, look at that. They're still going off. Do I need to set off them again? Oh, can you only set off a certain amount at a time? After a while, my game was not lagging as much, and I started being able to hear the explosions from the C4. See, and if I was in range of this, and I got hit by it, you know, we would be lagging so hard with each frame. Oh, we're actually hearing the explosions now. I just realized, I just heard an explosion. I finally got all of the 5000 C4 exploded and it made the sun. This was probably the biggest explosion in Dying Light 2. Yep, here goes the next bunch. That's all of them. That's it. Look at this. We're looking at the sun. We just made the sun. How long is the sun gonna be here? It's crazy looking. And, and look at that. The sun's gone, actually. Now it's just like... Sparks. Ooh. There we go. Holy crap, this <laughs> this freaking bus has been like D-shaped. The explosions finally stopped and the bus was painted with debris. Also, there was still light emanating from the inside of the bus like some sort of light source. Well, that's what the biggest explosion in Dying Light 2 looks like. Let me tell you, 5000 C4 takes a while to place, but it was worth the experiment to see what would happen in doing so. Anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy this video, it was a lot of fun to make. I have other videos that I'm currently working on, as well as an update video. If you care about the channel and want to see the direction that we'll be going in the future, please stick around for that as it'll be coming very soon.
Also, I'm currently looking to branch out from Dying Light 2 a bit to other games, so let me know in the comment section down below what other games you want me to try breaking. Anyway, I hope y'all have a wonderful rest of your day. Goodbye.